Hey guys, it's Asia, and I am back with a tag video. Um, I'm going to try to make this quick because my voice is kind of going in and out. <clears throat> but I wanted to say happy birthday to James Caldwell. Um, I was tagged by Jaded Nerd to do this birthday tag video. And I just want to talk a little bit about James, aka Milan Treasure, aka Spiller Boy TV. Um, and, you know, things that I like about James or why I started watching James in the first place. So I found him, I think he was in a, my recommended, but when I started watching him, I kind of felt like I knew him already. Um, Probably because I knew I had a, some a close family friend who I called an aunt. She was my my mother's best friend, and she had a similar spirit to James. And like so, watching him, I was just felt like I knew him, you know, because he was so much like my aunt. And um, she actually died, you know, fighting cancer, and he fall cancer one you know but and you know he's a superhero for that like he's a superhero I mean you who's out here fighting cancer and just winning like it's not <laughs> it's a lot of people who don't win and you know a couple people in my family fought it and didn't win so um I thought that was really cool that, you know, he fought and won and just his spirit, like his humor and his wit. Um, and he's very smart, very wise, you know, and he's just, he, he, the way he tells a joke, the way he sets up a story, like his laugh, he has like a really great laugh. Like if he starts you know, if he gets tickled by something and <laughs> he starts laughing, like, you can't help but laugh with him. So it's kind of infectious, you know? And, um, yeah, like, once I started to, like, kind of get into his his vibe, I was kind of like, I like him. He's really, I feel like watching him, I would learn, you know, I feel like I would learn something every time I watched him. And he would do Ask James and he'd give like really good advice to people. And part of the reason why I think he gives good advice is because he knows that he doesn't know everything. And I think that's important to to really, you know, keep close to you is that we don't know everything. A lot of people, they like to talk like they know everything. None of us know everything. Um... But yeah, I think that's part of the reason why he is so smart and so wise. Um, and it's one of the reasons why I uh, look up to James. And um, he's so talented when it comes to the things that he does as far as like being able to sew and being able to do hair and, you know, make jewelry and just the makeup and like. He really is creative um, and me being a creative person myself like I really admire how he's just able to just you know use his creativity to do the things that he wants to do you know with his drag and like he is unapologetically himself you know what I mean like it's not it's not always easy to get out on YouTube in front of people, um, whoever's going to watch and, you know, watch the video and really just be yourself. And he, he does that and he doesn't, he's not fake. He doesn't get up there and lie and tell lies and, you know, just, he don't get up there and just say things just to have something to say. Like when he comes to us, it's because, you know, he wants to, he wants to talk to us. He's not just there to, to try to waste time, you know? And I appreciate those things about him. Um, and the reads and the drags, like, 
he's a marksman when it comes to that stuff. So it really is like watching a um, just a, a, a sculptor just slowly create something and you just like, ooh, like watching it unfold in front of your eyes and then you just, at the end, he just cuts your head off. <laughs> He just, like, beheads you with, like, you know, but he just builds up to it and then he un unveils this, you know, masterpiece of, you know, a drag. I don't know, but he, <laughs> I don't know where I was going my analogies. Anyway, he's basically really good at what he does um, when it comes to... Uh, a battle of the of, of wits and um yeah he's he's a formidable opponent but he's also got a lot of heart and um he was there for you know people in their times of need I know he was there for me in times that I needed somebody and um yeah I really appreciate him and I don't want to get all weird and like emotional, but yeah, happy birthday. Um, I hope you have a good one and yeah, we'll be, we'll be around. <laughs> um, I'm getting weird now, so I'm going to go. Bye. <laughs>